Let's just cast our minds back to six years ago. It's August 2016. West Ham United's faced in Astrogrugu at the London Stadium. All West Ham has to do is win to go through into the Europe European group stage. And what's on the line is a chance to face Roma in Francesco Totti's last season as a professional player. Easy, right? Just a small team from Romania, right? No. We, we ruined it. We lost 1-0. And uh, the infamous Astragoo video, the infamous rants. But things have changed, you see. And since then, Astragoo has been relegated a few times and lost 10 0 the other day, so. And um, I mention that because West Ham's opponents in the Conference League for the first home opener is a team from Romania, Stauta Bucharest, or FCSB for short. At the present time, this club is not doing very well in its own league. It's only won one game all season. And manager Nikolai Dietje is already in the firing line because he's on the verge of getting sacked. Apparently, if FCSB loses this game, he's going to be sacked. Stau Bucharest infamously won the Champions League in 1986. Beating Barcelona on penalties. And it's one of Romania's most sex successful clubs. It's won the league 26 times. It's won the Romanian Cup 24 times. It's won the European Cup, rather, once. It's won the Intercontinental Cup as well. It's 63rd in the UEFA rankings. And um, it's been around for 75 years. As I look at the players, um, I did a little bit of research. Defender Risto Radnuovic played for Astro Grugu. He joined one year after West Ham lost to them. And also there's a guy that called Rashid Buena, who was an Algerian defender, who actually used to play for my hometown team, Doncaster Rovers. Well... He signed a contract with Doncaster but never made an appearance for the club. I ended up playing in uh, France and Scotland and went to play next in Romania. Um, I don't think this is an easy game on paper because don't forget this is a team that is used to playing in Europe as well and has quite an intimidating presence about it. It's got quite a talented team. 95% of the squad's Romanian, but they do have a few other players. They have an Estonian, a Cameroonian, a French player, an Italian, a player from Montenegro, and a player from Algeria, like I said. And the team captain is Florinel Coleman, and the vice captain is Octavian Popescu. Now, how's West Ham good affair against this slot? Well... The good news is that Moyes has made some positive affirmations about team rotation. Flynn Downs is expected to make an appearance in this game at last. I expect Skamaka to be back because he's now back in training and fully fit. Aguerd's going to be absent for a few months still, but he has the moon boot off, which is a good thing. Maybe even Coventry or somebody can have a shot in this game. Or maybe even Craig Dawson as well. That's a good point, Craig Dawson. Was amazing in York last season. He got the uh, Euro Europa League team of the season along with Declan Rice. So that's another thing to consider. Um, the one thing that was just a big talking point amongst West Ham fans was the low ticket sales for this. Even though the prices were very cheap. Um, personally, I would love to go to this if I were living in London. Because it's a European game. Obviously. And I want to go and see West Ham play in Europe. However, some people are not so keen, and uh, that's kind of disappointing. I was, I would expect West Ham to actually be fans to be interested. It's still a cup competition, you know. We we still have a chance to win a cup. So the fact a lot of fans didn't buy a lot of tickets at first concerned me quite a bit. Having said that, I think that this will be a very good game, and a Conference League game 
is not something that we should underestimate. This is still a very tough team. I know eight games are going to be easy in Europe, so we have to do our best and get results. Thank you very much for watching this very quick preview. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to sub for more content and take care, everybody. If you go into the game, then enjoy it. If you're a Romanian fan who's travelled to London, I hope you have a good time in the city. Take care, guys, and I'll see you all soon.